In Kisumu, the Kenya Maritime Authority is meeting stakeholders over the implementation of regulations aimed at improving safety on boats and other watercrafts on Lake Victoria. All right, let's now bring in Laura Otieno who is following that story. Laura, good morning. What are those regulations uh, and how have they been enforced? Well, indeed, good morning to you, Wahiga. And the Kenya Maritime is seeking to sensitize uh, the uh, relevant stakeholders on the regulations that they released in April uh, this year. And the regulations involve uh, the licensing of uh, ships and watercrafts, where some uh, of them include uh, ship owners and operators uh, operating. Those are foreign uh, ship owners who are supposed to register their vessels not later than 1st June 2019. And now it's two weeks into that deadline. So, of course, we expect uh, that the the authority will be giving us statistics on uh, whether uh, the owners have complied. Also on local uh, ownership of boats, uh, they were supposed to have registered their watercrafts not later than 20th May of this year. So of course those are some of the statistics that we expect the Director General to be giving today. And of course uh, the authority is also arguing that uh, the sensitization will go a long way in curbing water accidents which have been on the rise the past 10 years and 50% of those uh, accidents have been attributed to faulty watercrafts or, or faulty boats and 40% uh, uh, also have been uh, due to drowning but they are looking to uh, uh, majorly uh, look at watercrafts operating in, um, in a, uh, operating in an sea and seaworthy vessels that is and of course now they want to uh, weed out those vessels that are not uh, fit to go out to sea because remember there has also been the decline of fishing that has been forcing fishermen to go farther and farther into the lake and the implication of that the waves are stronger way inside the lake and so if the vessels are not really that uh, they are unseaworthy then they are risking their lives also they should be uh, sensitizing uh, the stakeholders here on matters of water safety I mean, how many people actually consider wearing uh, life jackets when going uh, boat riding or things like that? So, of course, those are some of the thorny issues that you expect the Director General, uh, Major Retired uh, George Okongo, to be giving us statistics on that when he makes his way into this particular forum. The County Commissioner is also expected to be making her way into this place to also weigh in on her recommendations on how to improve water safety here in Lake Victoria before the campaign spreads to other places such as Kwale and Lam as well. So, of course, now with that, we are taking a short breather here on Daybreak. We shall be resuming with more news.